So after saying these things, قالوا, if that was the case, قالوا, تلك إذن كرة خاسرة. They say it would be in that case, it would be in that case, it will be a return with loss, a losing return. Why is that? So they don't believe the hereafter, yet they say themselves, if we come back to life, then it, this will definitely be a losing return. Why is that? This is the state of the disbeliever. Those who disbelieve, what do they do in this dunya? They block out the hereafter. So when you block out the hereafter, there is no life after this life, what do you do? You will definitely follow your desires. You'll be running away from death. You'll be trying to follow anything that pleases you. Whatever your heart desires, you'll be doing. You don't care what's right, what's wrong. Even, even some people say, no, but I go by the book. Exactly, you go by the book, the law. If you find a way to trick the law or go without the law, without anyone catching you, to steal without anyone knowing, to cheat without anyone knowing, you will definitely do that. Because you won't believe in the hereafter. You won't believe that there's, there will be a God who will judge you by your actions. As long as no one sees, I can do whatever I want. So this is their state. And they know that if they will be brought back to life, it's gonna be a losing return, they will be losers. They will lose a lot. This also tells you that they didn't really fully disbelieve. It's not like something far-fetched that, that they will be brought back to life. Otherwise, why would they say it's a losing return? You know, there is a possibility that they will, be, they will return, but they shun it out. They don't want to even think about it. Why? Because they're too attached to this dunya. They are too attached to, this, to their desires. They know that if they follow uh, the messenger, that they will need to sacrifice a lot of things that they're doing in this life. So that's why they say, قَالُوا تِلْكَ إِذَنْ كَرَّةٌ خَاسِرًا A losing return.